Tech Tunes 2015. Today I got an unboxing of the Alcatel One Touch Pop Star. Funny story with this phone. This is the third phone that's exactly the same one I've had. I had it from Tesco. First, the first one I had a month ago today actually. And the 3G didn't work properly on it, so I took it back. Had a refund. Had this phone. Well, I had another phone for this. Exactly the same one. Same thing with it, that phone. Then they said there's a problem with the batch they added or something. And then they gave me this phone. So, hope this one works. So, on the box then is the front, which is Popstar 5.0. It's 5 inch. I'll tell. And it's got nothing on that side. On the back end, it's got all the specs. It says 5 inch 3G plus up to 21 megabits a second. A, four, a quad core, 8 megapixel front uh, back camera, sorry, and a 5 megapixel front facing camera. And it's got regular screen information and all that stuff. No one needs that. This is a 5022X, so there's only one SIM. On the top, then, I'm not going to show you, it's got all my details on it. So, let's get into it. So, on the back there, I know this is the wrong knife, but I really don't care. Slice it through. On the bottom. Got pretty strong tape actually. Just put that over there. And it should just slide out. And there I got my SIM card because I bought it with Tesco Mobile. Hopefully this one will work. On top then I got the phone. Got the back, it's got the white colour on the back. So I know you all like this, so put the phone now. Put the phone to the side there. The box then, it's like an iPhone box really. Pop that off. What we've got underneath here. That, I'm not sure what that is, so look. That's just got the uh, silver back. It's also got the gold back. Just put that over there next to the phone. And underneath the little tab there, then you've got USB cable. So it's USB to micro USB. And we've got the charging pick. Nice little storage area. And to charge you, just pop that into there like anything else, and that goes into the bottom of the phone, which is right there. Pop it in, and start charging. So, what else we have in the box? We've got the battery, so this is a removable battery. Phone does have a removable battery. This one's got a micro SD card expansion. And it's got some headphones. So, sorry them. Not expecting very much, but you know, standard pair of headphones. So, that is everything. Oh, there's the warranty information and quick start guide, which I'm probably never going to read in my life. Let's pop that over there then. I'll have to take the back off the phone, which is right there. The little uh, thumb hole there. Peel the back off, bring that way around. And it's actually already got a SIM card installed, so that's one thing I'd have to do. So let's pop the back here. This is. Yeah, what is this? 2000 mAh battery, which is, well, pretty small for a 5 inch phone. But I hope they got all the power saving stuff with Android 5.1. Actually, I might put the uh, gold back on. So that's what I got. Let's power on for the first time. Hope it's got some juice in the battery. And yes, it does.
I will be back when this is turned on. So as you as you can see now, this is actually turned on. It's going to go through the setup. English next. Ask me to connect my Wi-Fi. Yes, I'm with Talk Talk. Don't ask why. To my password. It's just connecting. Just checking the connection now. Playing to my Google account. I'll skip that for a minute. Skip. Is my first name? Which is. I'll type it upside down. So next, bottom then, it's not set a lock screen, skip anyway, yeah, I agree to all that stuff, and we're at the home screen, so far this is a pretty good experience, like pretty fluid swiping, can just start with quite a bit of bloatware well actually, we've got the apps, which is Alcatel's basically Alcatel's uh, app store backup and restore the internet browser I don't know why it comes with internet browser and google chrome god knows calculator it's a clock which I think is the standard google clock we have got the camera which overall isn't really that bad I will include some clips of the camera uh, so, where was I? Yeah, camera, there's the calendar, contacts, downloads, all that stuff. So, games is another bloatware they include. I think you can delete Google Keep and, uh, what is it? I think you can delete mi play music and Google Keep. Music there, I don't know why they got music and play music, God knows. They've got a uh, sound recorder, voice search, wallpaper store. The one thing I like about this phone is if you have to open up the wallpaper store, you can just agree to that, tap to scan there. On the back of the phone, you can actually pop this off. I'm not sure if you can see it there, but. Right down the bottom, there, there is a QR code. If I scan that QR code, it'll show me I've got gold. It'll show me a load of different wallpapers I can have that will actually suit the phone. Just to select one and see what it looks like. Download that. It's just been downloaded. Talk, talk about a long process. Wallpapers. It should be then. Okay, it's decided not to download. Let's try it again. Alright, there we go. Applied successfully. There we go. So now I've got the gold wallpaper which should match with the gold backplate anyway 
both sides to sneeze. Anyway, so I got the LED uh, backlit buttons there, touch sensitive, and then there's a clicky home button. Double click opens the camera. If you long hold, it will turn you take you to Google now, which I don't want to sign into yet. If you okay, if you drag down from the top once, it'll give you your notifications. Drag down again, then it'll give you Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, 3G options, and all that stuff. Turn off my location. This has got a flashlight as well, which is quite bright. And then you've got your brightness slide as well, which is which actually has real-time feedback. So you can change the volume by using the volume rockers on the side there. Pop it back later on, it looks nicer. So the volume rockers on the side there, so volume up, and then volume down, is on there. Then you've also got your power button there, let me click that one. Power button, so if you hold down the power button it will give you Power off, reboot, airplane mode, and it gives you silent, vibrate, and well, normal. Uh, home button, uh, headphone jack with microphone. There's an 8 megapixel camera up there. There's an LED notification light over there. And there's the camera, the earpiece, and along the back, then you've got the uh, speakers, camera, and LED flash, then they got another microphone and a micro USB port. So overall I that's my first the first look at the Actel One Touch Pop Star. So hope you enjoyed it and there will be a full detailed review coming soon. This is Jack from Tech 2015. Like, comment and subscribe. have my dog which is taken from the Alcatel pop store and we've got his ball coming up next as you can see it's very good uh, manual focus which is and here's some video clips as well so this is a test of the Alcatel pop star camera So this is a test of the Alcatel Popstar camera. To make an announcement. If Christian doesn't start uploading some shit, he will be replaced by the one and only Ross Usher, who is homeless and lives in Brinkalog School grounds. Yes, that's right, he will be replaced.